celebrate the pride month and with that we're going to use the makeup products from one size patrick star but before that please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done yet and like this video also hit that notification bell so that you'll get notified whenever i upload new videos okay let's get ready i'm so excited to try these products this is my first time to use these products since I featured this in my Sephora haul vlog. If you haven't watched that, I will share the link down below. And also, you can click it from right here. So, I only have three products with me that we will try today. So, for those of you who do not know Patrick Starr, he's a Filipino-American digital creator and makeup artist who seeks to challenge certain stigmas surrounding men wearing makeup. Hey everyone, it's Patrick Star. Welcome back to my channel. And he just recently started this brand, One Size, where his advocacy is to drive or to promote individuality. So according to Patrick Starr, makeup is a one-size-fits-all. One-size is redefining the beauty by elevating the voices of the unheard. So it pr really promotes individuality based on, based on his personal experience, I guess, being a makeup artist, freel freelance makeup artist himself. Everything here, the three products here, are all long-lasting. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try all of these and probably we do a wear test since I'm going out today in a man. Grocery full makeup like Heart Evangelista, right? So, let's first. So, I've already prepped my skin. I'm just going to start with my primer. this one size setting powder so what we're gonna do is this is a 14 hour blurring powder it stays on for 14 hours now so what I'm gonna do is um I'm gonna try to put just this on the right side and then on the left side we'll use a foundation so I'm going to use this Okay, so with foundation, without foundation, and then I, I put on my Fenty Beauty concealer. this one size ultimate setting powder this is in the shade what shade is this 
This is in the shade number one, translucent. So when you get this, doesn't have it doesn't have the baking puff. It has to be ordered separately. And I didn't order it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use a different baking puff. I still have to take out the sticker in here. So in case my shishido in puff instead. So, let's start with the left one. So, this one daw will last for 14, 14 hours. And then the right one, this doesn't have the foundation. Just add a little more on the other eye. So it says that this product extends the wear of your base products and it helps it set your foundation especially here that we put on foundation and it also has blurring effect so that the pores will not be visible so let's try the eye copper sparkle vision eyeshadow in the shade everything and more so i did a swatch again on this during my Sephora haul. But before putting this on, let's put a base first. Natasha Denona. So I'll first use Halo. Right now, let's use this Point May 24 Hour Liquid Eyeliner Pen. It's felt tip and it's in the shade Bodacious Black. Okay, putting this on. Now we're gonna do that on the other side. So again.
that their claim to long-lasting makeup is true we're going to do wear test so the eyeliner is 24 hour waterproof and it's smudge proof as well but I wouldn't wear this for 24 hours but we're going to do a wear test and see if it really is smudge proof and long-lasting and then the eye the eyeshadow popper is non flaky it really is hindi siya nag fall off also and it's easy to it's easy to to use and to to put on so now let's finish off the makeup and let's put on mascara <laughs> Let's try to use this Fenty Beauty Caramel Cutie. The setting powder looks good. 
I mean, parang nag -mat yung skin ko. And, and it's on, it's the same on both sides, whether I put on the the foundation or not. Nag even naman siya. It doesn't feel like this one is heavier because of the foundation and this one doesn't have. Right? So, if you're going to take a look at it, it evens out the texture of my skin. But, naganda siya. And then, lastly, we'll put on Boxum Lip Shine. Lip Polish. That is our look, our grocery look. I need to fix my hair pa. This is just air dried, but um, yeah, this is going to be my look today to do some grocery and some errands. So again, I hope you like this video. If you have any questions or if you have any comments, please leave it down below. I would really appreciate it and. Please, again, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. So, again, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Happy Pride Month! Bye! Bye, hey guys! Right now, I'm on my way to the laundry. Dropping my clothes to the laundry today. So, I'm going to be here because I loaded the bags over here. So, so far, after four hours, the makeup is still there. Like, the eye popper okay pa siya. no no fall off sometimes kasi inexpect ko mag fall off na yan under my eye but so far so good even the eyeliner no smudging happening at all and then I like the ultimate setting powder because keeps my face matte and yeah I like it by far the best setting powder that I have tried. So I'll keep you updated for another, probably for another four hours after I, I'm done with the grocery and other errands that I'm going to do today. So I'll be back. Hey guys, and this is after 10 hours of wearing this makeup. As you can see, the, the eyeshadow popper is still looking good. Although there's a bit of like some flakes and fallout over there, but it's it's super minimal. And then the eyeliner, it is still very, very perfectly winged. No signs of smudging at all. That is so awesome. And then the... You can tell from my face that I'm not that oily. I'm not that oily. I have... I haven't done any retouch. I haven't... I haven't put on anything on my face since I put on the setting powder. It, I'm not usually after 5 or 6 out, six hours or so you will see some oil building up on my forehead and then on on um, my eyebrows but surprisingly I am not that oily like even if it's not that it's not that hot currently but I've already been in the grocery had like an hour or two hours in the grocery picking up some stuff putting in the grocery bags here in the car and then I also had I also had my lunch outside I also went to to LBC to send out some stuff and yeah that's after 10 hours and it's still looking good super super real, super super effective for setting your skincare or your foundation or using it alone so both um, left and right part of part of my face there they are both even didn't see any 
oil coming out of my face that much. Like, really. It's so amazing. So, I feel like this is, this is going to be my, my go-to makeup going forward. Both, like all of three of them, the, the eye popper, I feel like I'm going to purchase more of their shades. I think they have five or six more. And the eyeliner, super, super impressive with the staying power. It's not smudging at all. And then of course, the setting powder. It is so awesome. It's it's super, super helpful to, to set your face and to use it for everyday wear. Very, very recommended. I highly recommend One Size Patrick Star. Good quality, very high quality makeup brand.